like being, being that vocal leader right off the bat? Yeah, the communication, Jay can communicate well out like there. You know, I don't, I don't talk that much, so that, that's a big deal. Communicate with other guys out like there. Uh, against Kentucky, you got that, that tackle in one of the last few plays they had. There was no one past you. Did you know in that moment, like, ah, I might have just saved the game? Yeah, I seen when he broke out, I knew I had to make a tackle, so I went over there and road tackle him. So I knew I, when I road tackle, I knew I was going to get on the ground. That wasn't a little guy you roll tackle either. Nah, he pretty thick. <laughs> How hard is, was it for you, or easy was it for you to just take over for Jason's role in terms of, you know, getting guys lined up, being vocal, you know, being that guy that, that gets everybody knowing what they're doing? I mean, it wasn't, it wasn't too bad. I, I've been doing it, but it's just when Jay left, I just had to step in the game up a little more. Yeah. What's the, effectively, what's the difference between free and safe in this system? Basically, in free, you, you're going to be in a box more, and in strong, you, you roam it. I can play both of them. I like both of them. Do you have a preference? Yeah, I like staying strong. Because you get to make calls? Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm curious about your point of view as a defensive back. When you see Jamie on the other side of the field, what's it like trying to defend him, I guess? Well, sir, I know how them guys feel. I hold him every day. <laughs> Man, he got some moves on him. He, they give him... Trying to make it option route what he want to do. But I know how they feel. Do you remind Jamie on that you used to be that Wildcat quarterback too in high school? Yeah, he know. He know. He's seen a couple highlights. <laughs> how much did playing quarterback in high school kind of help you back there in the secondary? Kind of to look to see what the, you kind of guess what those guys are thinking. Yeah, you're a leader back there. You know what that quarterback gonna do before he do it. When he, some some quarterbacks in college they, don't, they just look at their receiver, stare them down. So I know then what they gonna do. Uh, I guess quote, quote, experts uh, question the secondary and all their experience and stuff. How do you think you guys have answered those questions? I mean, we took a big step ahead. Everybody was down in us. We lost a couple corners and safety, but we just stepped up. All our young guys stepped up and did great. What are some of the things now that you have you know, started over while you feel like you, you, you've adapted to very quickly and you're doing really, really well right now? Uh, getting people lined up and knowing the offense on the board. Is that something that is, you know, I'm going to assert myself. I may not be the oldest guy out here, and I may not have the biggest reputation, but they're going to listen to me, and, and they are listening to you. Yeah, it's a big thing. You know, I'm, I'm small, I ain't that fast, so I got to be a coach I don't feel. I mean, you're a little better at than you give yourself credit for. <laughs> oh, yeah.